Hi, this is Trey Passer. Welcome to my Blu-ray uh, update for the week beginning April 29th, uh, 2018. Let's have a few titles. And of course, uh, two of the titles have digital codes giveaway, so those movies will be up for uh, my giveaway, digital code giveaway. This will be number seven, I believe. And that will happen later today, uh, probably around hopefully in the 7 o'clock hour. I'll do the drawing for that, but it'll be two movies. Uh, movies I've got only three movies this week, and two of them have digital codes to them, so those movies will be eligible for a digital code giveaway. So let me get right to it, so this video doesn't drag out forever. Uh, this movie I saw, came out early this year, I believe in January, I believe. Was it January? I think it was January. Anyway, it was a nice action movie. Uh, Starring Gerard Butler, uh, uh, O'Shea Jackson Jr., who's Ice Cube Jr., <laughs> put it that way, and Curtis, 50 Cent Jackson. And I'm talking about uh, Den of Thieves. Uh, this movie was uh, a nice action movie. Uh, intense, really intense uh, firefights and stuff. Really good. It's sort of like a, I guess, a poor man's uh, heat. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, <coughs> Excuse me. Wow, my voice went. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, now I'm back. <laughs> So I thought I went through puberty right there for a minute there. I know Den of Thieves, uh, so like a poor man's heat, but like I said, really nice and tense about this uh, gang of uh, thieves, you know, and these cops that, you know, the cops that are trying to stop them. Okay? That was good. It was a nice, uh, good action, good piece in there. Okay? Uh, anyway, uh, the next movie is a the third part of a trilogy. I really enjoyed this series. I know this is based on a book. Which I never read, but I enjoyed the series, the first two episodes, and this is the conclusion. And I'm talking about Maze Runner, The Death Cure. Uh, I really enjoyed uh, this series a lot. And the guy who's the lead, uh, Dylan O'Brien, in there, uh, when I saw him in uh, American Assassin, I said, This guy should be Nightwing. Okay, just the way he is in that movie. If you see that movie, if you've seen that movie, American Assassin, he, I think he'd be the perfect uh, Dick Grayson, Nightwing, if they ever make that movie. He should uh, definitely Dylan O'Brien because he, you know, he had the right look, and he looked, he could handle the physicality to me. So I think he would, he would be perfect as as a uh, Dick Grayson. I know he's sorry. I know he's young still. I think he's in his mid twenties. I think, but I think he's young enough so he could be uh, uh, Nightwing. And I hope they test him for that. I hope he tries out for that because I think he would be perfect based on American Assassin. See that movie, and you know what I'm talking about. He has the perfect look. To be Nightwing, okay, Dick Grayson. Hopefully, they'll, you know, when they make that movie, the guy I think was making, uh, who made the Batman, uh, Lego, Batman, Lego, Lego Batman is supposed to be making that movie, so definitely uh, pick him. That's just an inside tip, okay? There we go. So, the digital code giveaway for that one as well. And now, uh, this movie is a collector's edition, a shop factory or screen factory, right? I always get those confused. Uh, I think this is screen factory, yeah, screen factory. Uh, this is a, a horror movie that I, this, and me and, uh, my friend were actually talking about this movie the other day at work, and, and I, I remember I bought the DVD of this movie, uh, because I saw it in a video store, and, the, you know, the cover got to me, you know, the title got to me, and I saw it, and I bought it, and they just, whoa, the movie was super intense, and they showed it on cable a lot, okay, and this is a Sam Raimi film, <laughs> and, I'm talking about Drag Me to Hell, okay? This is an all-new collector's edition, unrated in theatrical cuts of the film, plus interviews with actors Alison Lohman and Lorna Raver. Anyway, this is a great movie. Uh, this uh, uh, Christine Brown, played by Alison Lohman, who's, uh, she's the, uh, like, a, a upcoming, she works in a bank, but she's trying to get a promotion, and basically the bank manager kind of makes her, forces her to, like, deny this gypsy woman uh, alone or on her house or something, and... and the woman basically curses her, basically, and, and she spends the rest of the movie trying to avoid this curse, trying to get this curse lifted off her and stuff, and it has a, and Justin Long is in this as well, and for those who say Justin Long, if anybody ever said Justin Long can't act, the last scene in this movie, the look on his face is priceless, it's just beyond priceless, there should be screen captures of his face, that's a, the look, the, just the look on his face it's just, it's beyond priceless, okay? And it, and Sam Raimi captured it perfectly. Uh, and, and this is, I'm interested in seeing this. This has a ton of special features. This is two-disc collection. Again, this is a screen factory. I know they have 
a different version. And this was, like I said, a real nice price. I think it was thirteen ninety nine, which is a good price, I think, for a collector's edition of a, of a great horror movie. Okay, Drag Me to Hell. Okay, so not only uh, does he did you know the, the Evil Dead movies, but this movie, as uh, Sam Raimi, is absolutely really a, to me. It's, it's like a cult classic to me. Okay, so Drag Me to Hell. Okay, okay, there you go. So that's it. Okay, so uh, let me know what you think of these titles. Uh, you know, feel free to you know leave comments down below. And again, uh, these two movies will be a digital code giveaway. So if you want to enter the digital code giveaway for Death Cure and Den of Thieves, you have to be a subscriber to this channel. Okay, tell me what you what movie you want underneath this video. Okay, let's say tell me which movie you that you want to be entered for. Which movie you want to be entered for? You can enter for both of those, but. Like I said in my uh, vlog uh, yesterday, uh, if you win, like say if you win, you put in for both movies and you win Death Cure, then I'll take you immediately out of the running for Den of Thieves, okay? So I think that's only fair, so that way somebody else has an equal chance. It won't be, like for this, it won't be two, the same person winning twice. If I pull the, the second person's name, the same person's name for the second movie, then that person I will disqualify, well not disqualify, I just, you know, I'll pick another name, okay? That way more people have an equal chance to win is what I'm my point. <laughs> I want people to have a you know equal chance to win, okay? Which is my point I think. <laughs> uh, I want them to have an equal chance to win. Okay, so that's it again. So feel free to leave comments down below. Okay, I have links to my social media, my Facebook, my Twitter, and my Instagram in the description box, as well as my other channel, Bug Views and Opinions. And again on this channel I just uploaded my uh, reviews my spoiler, well, my spoiler-free review of Avengers Infinity War and spoilers review with spoilers of Avengers Infinity War. That, that's on these on this channel. So if you want to check those videos out, you can just you know, you know, watch this channel. Okay. So anyway, that's it for this week. And again, good luck to anybody that's going to enter the contest. Again, remember the rules. You got to be a subscriber. Okay. You can just tell me which movie you want to be entered for. You can enter for both movies, but if you win one, you know you can't win the other. Okay. So that's just a little. I just want to clarify that point, okay? Anyway, this is uh, Trey Pastor saying so long and take care.